But if you look at the history of the Jews over the last 2,000 years, have they been blessed by God? No, they've been persecuted and hated in every country that they've ever been in. This book right here has a list of all of the countries that the Jews have been thrown out of over the last 1,000 years. And when you look at this huge list, you have to ask yourself, why have they been so hated and persecuted everywhere that they've lived? And the answer is because of their blasphemy toward Christianity and because of their predatory lending practices. In the late 1800s, persecution of the Jews in Russia and elsewhere intensified, and many Jews began to believe that their only hope for a prosperous future would be to possess a state of their own. This belief became known as Zionism. The Jewish state was the uh, realization of the great project of Theodor Herzl. Theodor Herzl. He was the founder of Zionism. But he came to the idea that the cause of anti-Semitism is because the Jews do not have a state of their own. Mm -hmm. And he wrote a little booklet, The State of the Jews. He said there is only one way of protecting the Jewish people in the future, for the Jews to leave Europe mm -hmm. and to settle in their homeland, the land of Israel. Mm -hmm. And that book became like the Bible of Zionism. Zionism was the formation of the hope for the rebirth. It started with World War I, mm -hmm. the Balfour Declaration. The Balfour Declaration was significant. Mm -hmm. It wasn't just a letter to a friend. I mean, it had, Right, no, I understand it, it was a major document. In terms of expressing yeah. British policy. Mm -hmm. So the Balfour Declaration was a letter from Lord Balfour to, to Lord, Lord Rothschild. Rothschild. 